Hey guys, welcome to Crypto Mining Insider. I have huge news to share with you today. It's probably the biggest news in mining in a really, really long time. NiceHash, in a blog post dated today, May 7th, they've announced they have achieved 100% LHR unlock. So if you go to the NiceHash blog page, you'll see this article right here. Let me click into it. They have stated 100% LHR unlock at NiceHash, question mark. It's here though. We are very excited to tell you that NiceHash Quick Miner Excavator is the first mining software to fully 100% unlock LHR cards. Now you can earn more profits than ever by mining software on the market if you're using LHR graphic cards with NiceHash Quick Miner. Support for the NiceHash Miner will be coming soon. There's also an image on their page, and if I zoom into it, it's a nice hash status message from their miner showing on the 3080 Ti, they're getting 120.12 mega hash. Wow, that's incredible. I'm really excited and dying to try this out. But with that said, with this version of the miner, you can scroll down and you can download from the Quick Miner. There's an important notice here. You must use Quick Miner version 0.5.4.0 RC. So it's a release candidate. It's like a beta. It's not a formal release when installing the Quick Miner. And the current stable version is 0.5.36. Oh, we don't care about that. We only care about this getting 100% LHR unlock. So you can download from here, or I also see it's posted up on the NiceHash on their GitHub site. You see pre-release version 0.5.4.0 RC. I'll be putting a link down to their GitHub page in the video description for you to access quick. And this is an untested version. So the latest stable version can be downloaded here. After downloading, make sure to check, check some, oh, enough of this, blah, blah, blah. I'm really interested in downloading this miner, so I'm gonna download this miner and I'm actually gonna throw it over onto my LHR rig. I'm gonna be testing all of my LHR cards with it. So let's get into it. Switching over to my LHR rig, I've already downloaded and installed the new version of the NiceHash Quick Miner. So let's start this up. And yes, I'm going to approve it. I already had set up my wallet account uh, just prior to doing this off camera. But wow, look, I see a new screen. You are ready to go with this new start mining. This is really, really exciting. Are we ready to do it? Are we ready to take a look? Oh, before we do that though, so Excavator is up in the background right now. And let me see what it's saying. It's not actively mining. See, one thing that's different about Excavator than the other miners is with Quick Miner using Excavator, it starts up the miner and it'll pause and run it and pause and run it. So it's not like it totally closes the miner restarts it totally closes it so it seems to be communicating back and forth so it'll tell it okay it's mine or start to mine so this is basically all configured up now i see it's realized one zero one two three four five six seven so it's realized all eight of my lhr gpus i have all six of my primary lhr gpu models ranging from 3060 3060 ti 3070 3070 ti 3080 and a 3080 ti card so we have all of my cards I've already told it to set up some of the overclocking and it's doing unlock ratio. It's saying, wow, 100%. And it set up its overclocks, but it's not doing anything yet. So are we ready to press this button? I don't know about you, I'm kind of nervous. Ready? At the same time, ready? One, two, three, let's do it. Okay, so I click the start mining button and let me just bring up this miner here. I see I'm getting some shares accepted. Anti-LHR is showing that it's enabled on these cards. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Wow, my first message I'm seeing, it's reversing the device order, but my 3080 Ti, it's giving me 120.11 mega hash. My 3080 is giving me 95. My 3070 Ti's are giving me 78.47. I think I can tune them up a little bit more and do a little bit more with the overclocking. But wow, this is like right out of the box and I'm just assigning a medium overclock to it using the OC tune. Okay, so I'm getting a rejected share share above target so maybe the overclocking is a little bit too high for this but look at these mining results this is epic this is 120 mega hash for a 3080 ti card it's mining just like a 3090 would this is an absolute game changer and i'm really really excited about this let's step over to uh, the nice hash miner and see how the statistics look Switching over to nice hash. Uh, I'm going to my rig manager. Let me go to this rig and I'm gonna click it in. Some of these cards are running a little too hot, but look, my 3080 Ti is giving me 120.88 mega hash. My 3080 is giving me 95.81. 
My 3070 Ti, it's showing me at 79.09. So I'm going to be seeing if I can dial that number in and get a little bit better out of it. My other 3070 Ti is also giving me 79.11. My 3070 is giving me 60.47. Wow, that's incredible. And an efficiency here is saying it about 0.54, so like a 540 efficiency. That is absolutely epic. This is a total game changer for mining. My 3060 Ti is saying is giving me 59.27, so it's acting just like a full hash card. My 3060 is giving me 47.21, so wow. And my other LHR V2 is giving me 47.2. These are the most incredible numbers I've ever seen out of LHR cards. And if I didn't know them any better, I wouldn't even think they were LHR cards. To see 121 mega hash now, Wow, let me just flip back to the miner. This is just, I am so blown away, but I also see there's some stability issues. So there is some crashing going on with the miner sometimes where I'm seeing it restart. These numbers are epic. Look at this, 120.35 mega hash on my 3080 Ti card. So my 3080 Ti is performing like a full hash rate 3090 card. And all the other cards too, 95 mega hash on my 3080, 78.9, 78.72 on my 3070 Ti's. I'm getting 60 mega hash out of my 3070 with a 543 efficiency. So if I didn't know any better, I would swear I was looking at a screen full of full hash rate cards. How about you? I'm extremely excited about these mining results. However, I'm seeing there's some stability issues with the miner. It's crashed on me about four to five times so far. That may be due to the overclock settings that's part of medium with the OC2 and utility. I'm gonna be working to refine them to see if I can get them running more stable. But until I can see this running over any time, I can't verify any of my mining results that these are not just numbers on the screen. I wanna see these numbers recognized in the miner as well as recognized more importantly in my wallet. Frequently when I go to the nice hash and I go to the rig manager, I see today, especially it's in maintenance mode a lot. So I'm not able to see any justifiable or quantifiable numbers from them yet. But I'm gonna be definitely keeping this uh, really, really close eye on this. This is an epic, spe I'm speechless game changer. So market calendars, it's May 7th of 2022. And it seems like LHR has been defeated if this holds true, but time will tell. I have to see the numbers first in the minor. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give me a big thumbs up, like, and drop a comment down below. Let me know how your mining results and experiences with this. Till next time, stay safe. I'll see you on the next video. Happy mining.